Welcome to Transport Fever 2, folks. We are jumping into a brand new playthrough, a free game, and we are going to play on this seed, T4IJ. It'll be in, this, in the description as well if you want to play along. We're playing on very large. We are playing on a map for, format 1 to 2, high number of towns, high number of industries. Uh, we're in temperate climate. And we have a bunch of mods. We'll be starting in 1850. And here are the mods. I'll leave it here for a second so that you can pause the video and see if you want to add them. One of the mods we have is uh, Expanded Cargo Demands, uh, Dynamic, which means that once we hit 1920, our towns will demand four. Uh, types of cargo instead of two and I think it's in 1970 uh, they'll demand six types of cargo so more mods here so these guys go ahead and pause if you want to add them and then the guys down here these are not activated so that's the mods that we'll be playing with. We'll be playing on medium difficulty. Let's go ahead and start. If you're into Transport Fever 2, it would be great if you would leave a like. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you're notified when new videos comes out. And also comment your to your heart's content. I read all my comments, I reply to by far the most of them, and I love getting comments, so uh, leave comments uh, with su suggestions and uh, criticism, uh, constructive criticism not, criticism, not just you're an idiot or something, uh, but constructive criticism, criticism is very much appreciated. So uh, yeah, let's let the map load and we'll be back all righty we are almost there there we go let's go ahead and pause immediately i don't want that on and we're gonna head over here i already took a quick look at the map uh and minneapolis here needs fuel now we have oil, we have a refinery, uh, an oil refinery, and we have a fuel refinery, and we can send that into uh, Minneapolis, and we can send it down to Sacramento as well, which is really nice. So we're going to set up a little truck line, I think, uh, doing this because uh, here at the beginning uh, the only train we have access to is the Baldwin and to be quite honest and a little bit rude the Baldwin sucks the Baldwin absolutely sucks so we're gonna hook up a road here then we'll hook up a road over here and that'll be our first line So let's go ahead and build. We'll come over this way. And then we'll come into there. And then we will have a road coming out this way as well. And like that. And like that. Okay, so that'll be our first route. So we want a truck station. And I think I want it to be 30 meters long. Uh, we'd only want one platform down here. So let's stick this in right here. So, 
Then we want a truck stop up here, and here we want two platforms. And I think we will rotate it like that. And we'll stick it in right here. Then we want a truck stop over here, where we also want two platforms. And we'll stick that in like so. Actually, I want three platforms here, but we can add another platform on later. And I might want three platforms on here, but again, we can add it on later because this takes two crude to make one oil. So having two oil wells delivering to it would be good. And there's another oil well over here. So let's go ahead and set up some lines. We want one... One line, two lines, three lines. Okay. And this line will go from there to there. And then this line will go from there to there. And this line will go from, well, we need a unloads thing, and we want it up here in this end, where all the fuel demand is. So we'll have the truck stop there, and the third line will go from there to down here. Okay. Now, this one we will name uh, Min Crude Trucks. This one we'll call Min Oil Trucks. And this one we'll call min fuel trucks. Okay. Now we're gonna need a couple of road depots. I think we'll stick one down here. something like that and then I think we'll stick one over here something like that okay so you buy vehicles we want cargo and we want probably 10 of these. Bye. And we'll select all of you and we'll set you to min root trucks. Then we will buy another 10 vehicles. And we'll set you on min oil trucks. And then over here, we will buy another 10 vehicles. And we'll set you on min fuel trucks. 
Okay. Our first charges are coming out. There they are. All pretty. And we have our first line set up. Fantastic. Fan freaking tastic. And how much do we have sitting here? 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. So wonderful. We'll be picking all that up. And this route is about half the length of this route, so it should be fine with 10 to 10. You know, we could build a road out like this to shorten this route. Let's do that. There. That'll be much better. All right. We are loading. And they'll spread out. That's why it's just sitting there, it's because it's waiting to spread out. Okay, so that's our first route. Now, we could, uh, let's take a look here. And terminals, we have, yeah, that's fine. And here, yeah, that's fine. So I think I'm going to set up a coach line from Sacramento to Minneapolis and another one from Minneapolis to North Las Vegas. Because I think that makes sense. They generally don't make that much money, but it's fine. Um, so let's set up a bus stop here. Um, set up there. And then we'll set up up here. And down in Sacramento. Okay. And we'll create two new lines. They're not going to be the same color. Uh, let's make you that color. Uh, and this line will be... Min uh, in LV North Las Vegas, and this one will be Min Sac. Okay, and we can actually buy the vehicles for the Min North Las Vegas line here so we'll buy let's say 10 again uh, but we want passenger vehicles and you go on min north las vegas and then i think down here we'll buy a road depot and stick in down here that and here we'll buy another 10 Oops. 
and we'll stick you on min sack. Min sack. Why are you not going on min sack? Go on min sack. Go on min sack. Why are they not going on the route? There is roads. Okay. Uh. All right. Let's try that again. Five vehicles, ten horse-drawn carriages, by for the min sack group. Oh, I know why, I know why. I haven't set up. All right, at station. Uh, this one. Two. This one. Okay, and here we'll go from this one to this one. All right. That's probably better. Now, these vehicles are going now. And these are going... Where are you on... Minsack. Okay, good. Alright. We are delivering up here, which is great. You haven't picked up anything. You have two on board, good. You are full and you make, what, 6,000? Not bad. You're full now. Uh, not full, but almost. Almost. This just needs to spread out a bit, and then it will be fine. Alright. And... What are you bringing? Nothing. Nothing. Okay. It's fine. Here we have our character. Oh, no, that's Melissa Evans, who is going somewhere. Huh? And Ashley Brooks. Hey. And Charles Lopez. Okay. Do we have people waiting here? We do. Four for the Minsack and one for Min NLV. What about down here in Sacramento? We have people waiting as well. Outstanding. Don't know why you're all going the same way. Let's reverse you. Reverse you. Reverse you. Reverse you. And reverse you. That'll be better. And we'll do the same with these guys. Uh, reverse. 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 And reverse. Okay.
But let's speed things up a bit. We are producing. We have oil centering around waiting here. Outstanding. You're coming in empty and not picking anything up. Well, that, that's to be expected. Uh, you must have something. No, you don't. You must have something. Yes, you do. Wonderful. You are going to drop off. And how much are we going to wait from that? 5,600. Okay. 5,600. Okay, and are you getting stuff now? Yes, you are. Outstanding. Outstanding. So, we have business going on. Uh, I don't want to see the costs going off all the time, or the income for that matter. Because we can just go down here and take a look. So, we've lost a bit of money, but it's fine. We'll make it back. Now, are there other nice little routes that we can set up here for a starter? Uh, there is one up here which is oil well oil refinery fuel refinery and charlotte needs fuel and el monte needs fuel so that's actually not half bad And there's actually an oil well right there. That would be more efficient. Yeah. Okay. Let's set this up. First of all, I really want to do this. If I'm honest, so it doesn't have to go up there. And then I really want to do this. Okie dokie. Buildings. Truck station. Uh, we need one platform for this one. platforms for this one, maybe three, but we'll fix that later if needed. There. And then we need two platforms here. Actually, three. Let's stick another platform on there immediately do like that then we need a truck unload stop looks like we cover everything there and we'll stick a truck unload stop in down here as well Okay, then we need some road depots, uh, we can just stick one in here, and that'll handle those two, then we can stick one in down here. Okay. 
Turkey. Whoa. We are having a storm in Bangkok. All right. So, new line. We need one, two, three. Let's start with three. And we'll add a station here, there, to there. And this will be... Cha. Uh, crude trucks. And then we will do here, from there to there, and this will be chat oil trucks, and then we'll do from there to there, and that will be chat uh, fuel trucks. Okay. So, buy vehicles, uh, cargo, we'll buy 10, and we'll stick you on the crew trucks. Then we'll do another, uh, I think we'll do 15 here. And we'll stick you on the oil trucks. And then we'll do, I think just five here actually, because it's such a short route. Uh, and this will be the fuel trucks. Okay. Okay. So that's another few routes up and running. Let's have a look at our lines and see how they're doing. We are making money. The min sack is actually doing very well. Min crew trucks. Not bad, not bad. Okay. So how much does Minneapolis actually want? 83, and we're only giving it 28. So we could probably double up on everything. How much are you producing? 900, we're shipping 400. So yeah. Let's buy 10 and stick you on the min crew trucks. Okay. Now we have to remember, we could also send it down to Sacramento and even down to Gresham down here. But that's a bit far for trucks. I mean, we'll, we'll do a, a train line for 
uh, in the long term. We just need time to go buy, buy a bit so that we get up to a better uh, train. And we of course need to make money during that time. So here we are completely full. Wow, look at that. Uh, we could probably do with some more trucks on this. Uh, let's do another 10. And we'll stick you on check crew trucks. Okay. Now there is actually uh, we could make wood to or logs into uh, planks and into tools and deliver to Charlotte as well. That is a possibility. And even to El Monte too. It's not a bad plan. That is not a bad plan. Okay, we have a little operation going. Um, let's have a quick look at our lines here. So the crew trucks are making very good money. And so is Minneapolis, North Las Vegas. Minneapolis, Sacramento isn't that great. Uh, it probably needs a few more A few more carriages on it, I think. I think it needs a few more carriages on it. Yeah. Yeah, let's stick five more carriages on here. Uh, one passenger, five, and we'll stick you on Minsack. Okay. How many people are waiting here? Sorry, Gabrielle, I didn't mean to poke you. 66. We probably need a few more people on, or a few more carriages on this as well. We definitely do. Five vehicles. Uh, let's double up. And put you on North Las Vegas. Alright, we're already in 1855, so new trains will be coming soon, which will be wonderful. We could even do a Vancouver North Las Vegas. Maybe over to Visalia and Grand Rapids. It is a possibility. Now, the middle of the map is around here, right? Yeah, somewhere around here. Uh, so I'm kind of thinking that I want to keep it in two separate networks uh, for the passengers and the goods so that we kind of force planes when, uh, when we get to the point where we have planes. Well, there's a lot of fuel waiting. Uh, we only have five on the f fuel trucks, right? 
Yeah. We probably need another five. Uh, cargo. Five. Okay, this is looking good. This is looking good. How are our earnings looking? Okay, so 264,000 in 1855. So we actually made money. Well, we would have made money if uh, we hadn't spent a lot of money. But look at that. Returning a profit. Is it a big profit? No, it's not. But uh, it's a profit. And we haven't taken out any more loans. We've only loaned the five million. We could loan another five million if we wanted. But I think I'm good with taking it a little bit slow right now. Uh, we're not producing a whole lot. Maybe we need to ship more. We don't really have anything lying around waiting. Let's buy another five. And stick you on the min oil trucks. Okay. This is looking good. We are off to a decent start, I think. We are off to a decent start, I think. And we should make money. We should make money. So, yeah. 300,000, 306,000. And we only invested for 119,000 this month or this year. So yeah, we're definitely making money. We are definitely making money. So I, uh, I hope you're excited about Transport Fever. I know I am really excited. I can't wait to get into the trains, man. I love the trains. And also some shipping, if we can find some good shipping routes. Uh, but we'll have to look for these things in the next one because we are out of time. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.